holiday travel season has been anything but smooth sailing. Thousands of flights were canceled leading up to Christmas because of that massive cold front and storm. Now airlines are trying to play catch up while also dealing with a huge mess of luggage and those bags left to separated from their owners after one pair made it. The other didn't. This is what baggage claim looked like earlier today at Tampa International Airport. And that is where our JJ Burton joins us tonight. JJ people not happy when they see images like that one. And bags still look like that out here. You can see thousands of bags are here. And this line here is just some people waiting to get into the Southwest office to ask questions as to where their bags are. But thousands of bags here at the airport. And this is not just an issue at this airport. It's with Southwest Airlines across the country, they say, all due to that weather in the Midwest and the Northeast. Now I'm down here in the boneyard looking for my luggage. This has been Southwest Airlines baggage situation at Tampa International all day. I knew that it was from all the flights that's been canceled. According to TIA, Robert Benson is right. It's all due to canceled flights. Our luggage is lost. They're not really sure where it was. We flew in about 3.30 last night, and at 4 o'clock we got in line, and they told us that our bags were stuck in D.C. This is day one of Alana Korshke and her husband's vacation. They were told their luggage would be here by 6 this morning. We caught up with them a little afternoon, and they were still in line and still no bags. But they aren't letting this get them down. We're big travelers. We travel all over the world. It's happened before, and so nothing you can do about it. We go to Walmart, we buy a few things, and you're on your way. Nearly all airlines here at TIA dealt with canceled or delayed flights Monday. The baggage issue, though, only a Southwest problem, and it's impacting hundreds of their flights across the country. We reached out to Southwest, and they tell us this is all due to the winter storm that hit the Midwest and the Northeast. They're asking for your understanding as they work to get things back in order. With what's all happened in the past two or three years, you know, what are you going to do, explode through the top of your head or just go along with it, you know? And back out here live again, you're taking a look at all those bags in this line here. Again, this is a, an issue across the country, not just at this airport. Southwest did release a statement again a few minutes ago and basically saying they are working hard to get this on, on under control across this across the country and see some people again. And the good news, though, I will say, talking to some, some of the people out here, even though it's frustrating, a lot of people are just calm and chill and, and just going with it, saying it could have been worse. But again, Southwest is working to get this all under control. Reporting live at Tampa International, I'm JJ Burton, ABC Action News.